Good day! I am Haley Doreen Villarwell Pai, a grade 12 STEM student from Puerto Princesa City National Science High School. Today, I am going to give my review on the novel published by Toni Morrison in the year 1970 titled The Bluest Eyes. The book is all about an African-American girl named Picola Breedlove. The story takes place in Lorraine, Ohio during the years 1940 to 1941. Her story was narrated from multiple perspectives, Claudio McTeer being the main narrator who narrates in a mixture of a child's and an adult's perspective, and lastly, an omniscient narrator. The story tells how Piccola ended up living with the McTeer family, how she got wrongly blamed for killing a boy's cat, why she wanted to have the bluest eyes, and how she ended up losing her mind in the end. What I like about the book is that in the beginning, it shows this symbolism in the form of the short story of Mother, Father, Dick, and Jane, which helps the readers understand the flow of the story more. The book is also divided into four sections, each section being named after a certain season. And the book talks about real-life problems which people can relate to and it touches the heart of others. That's why I like it. What I least like in the book is its depiction of sex, violence, racism, incest, and child molestation. It gives the readers this heavy feeling and it's sometimes too much to handle. The character I like the best in the book is Claudia McTeer. She has the personality of a strong and independent woman. I liked how she defended Piccola from a group of boys harassing her and how Claudia with her sister Frida planned to save Piccola's baby from the community's rejection. She became like a support system to Piccola, that's why I like her. I would rate this book a 4 out of 5 stars because the plot of the book is good, that is no question. But the genre though, the genre it contains can be too overwhelming, especially for children. I would not recommend this book to children, but I would recommend this book especially to adults because it opens the topic about racism and child and women abuse which is a worldwide ongoing issue. By reading this book, people can get an insight about those issues and it can give them courage to voice out their opinions and arguments with the said issues. Again, I am Haley Doreen Villarwell Pai, a grade 12 STEM student from Puerto Princesa City National Science High School, and that is my book review.